like to show you a tablescape that I did for the spring and summer months. My inspiration for the table is this paper placemat from Hester and Cook. It comes in a set of 12, and it's a wonderful display here of beautiful flowers and a blue and white urn. And so I've decided to make my whole tablescape around this certain placemat. They're wonderful because they're disposable and your guests, after they're done, can throw them out. Uh, if your guests aren't too messy, you could also reuse them maybe once or twice. And then I do have some clients that actually laminate them and use them time and time again. So I'm going to put my placemat down here first. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to use basically a white plate because the placemat is so busy and colorful, I don't want to take away from the prettiness of the placemat. So I'm going to use my white dinner plate and salad plate. And then Hester and Cook also has what's called a table accents. And this is a blue and white jar, and I've put a, one of my guests' name on the jar, and then I can lay that right on the plate, and that tells where she's supposed to sit. You can also use the table accents for other, other ways. Here we can put the jar back on the plate again, and we can actually put our flatware on there. And that's a nice way to do it. Also, if you're having a brunch or something and you want to put the menu, you can just write the menu on top of the table accent. That makes a nice look. We have um, our napkin rings too, which are kind of fun in the, in the blue and white motif. We have a local artist, Michelle Ferguson, who makes these wonderful napkin rings. And she's done with a blue and white jar, and it, and it looks great uh, with our napkins. We come down to the next, next uh, table place setting. We have taken the bowl that uh, goes with the rest of the, the tableware and I filled the bowl up with water and I've put a clipping of one of the camellias from out in the garden center to add a pop of color for the place setting. So that's also nice. Some of the other blue and white items that I have on the table are wonderful salt and pepper sets. I'll show you a few of those right here and they're, they're great. They just add a little more blue and white color to the table. Here is a blue and white salt and pepper in a cube shape. They hold quite a bit of salt and pepper. But I also have some wonderful little figurines uh, that are fun to use as well. Here is a, a rabbit, and we have a turtle, which is kind of low country feeling. We have, for your cat fans out there, we have some cute little cat salt and pepper sets. We have a wonderful pineapple, which means welcome when you come to your home. And then I also have some cute little frogs here too for your garden people. Now in the center of the table, I've decided to do some fresh flowers as well as some uh, live plants. So in the center I have this riser, it's a cake riser, and I've put uh, three different white vases in the center here and I've also done some fresh flowers. I've clipped some things from the yard, uh, some pink and white flowers with greenery put that on the top of the, of the riser in the center of the table. And then off to the left here, I have a blue and white platter, and we have some cute little blue and white uh, mug vases, which you can add fresh flowers to, which is nice. And then over on the other side of the centerpiece, I have these three plants, and they are in really cute little blue and white pots. Uh, we have a, a Dracaena, we have a Pothos, and we have a Salgenella, and they're, they're pretty. They're in a limey green color, which kind of brings out more of that lime green that's in the placemat. So that is my tablescape, and you can um, come into the Greenery Garden Center Gift and Home Shop and see all the other kind of placemats that we have, and we can also give you some great ideas for your tablescaping. You can call me at 843 592-3759 if you have any questions. Thank you again.